Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Bali is well known for its legendary temples, and one of the temples is related to the story of Kebo Iwo. In no minutes, we are going towards the story presented by G Class. Well, without further ado, let's check this story out. If I succeed in conquering Nusantara, then I will break my path. If Gurun, Seram, Tanjungpura, Pahang, Dombu, Sunda, Tumasik, and Palembang, they are all defeated, then I will break my path. Meanwhile, in Bali Island, there was a family, Sri Arya Karang Bunjing and his wife, that has rich wealth. However, they didn't have any children. They pray every day, spend their day in surrender to the God, and kept praying for a blessing in children. Until one day, they came to go to the temple and pray for a child. They went there with honesty and sincerity to God that they would be blessed with a child later on. That's a blessing.
to pray in Gadu Temple. They can believe that there will be weep and the love of child. Until one day, the God answered their prayer. The wife was pregnant. They were very happy. Finally, born a baby with name Kabo Iwa. that is placed in front of Puri Bedahulu or Bedahulu Kingdom where the villagers are walking around to do some trading. Oh, you mean you're not so busy? 
that suitable for him. After stand the house, the villager tell Kebo Iwa about the house that they have built for him. Kebo Iwa is very happy and thankful to the villager. Next day, one of the villagers brings some food for Kabo Iwak. 